All right, fellas, bring it in. Time for the monthly working in the weather safety meeting. Whew, it just gives me chills thinking about it. Does anybody have any questions or comments or concerns before we start this? I, I got one right here. Uh, how exactly are we supposed to prepare for the weather on a job site in the southern U.S.? Okay, the high for today is 76 with a 20% chance of snow. So I, I'm not real sure how the fuck we're supposed to prepare for that. That's actually a really good question. Uh, so weather is a wee bit sporadic in the southern U.S. about this time of year. Uh, I know when you got up out of bed this morning headed to work, it was 17 degrees. And then when you drove 30 minutes to work, it was 64 when you got here. I understand that confusion. I do. But we're just going to have to work around that, and we're going to have to make it work. Okay, okay, we're, we're going to make it work. So let me process this. When I show up to work in the mornings, I may need thermal zone, a hoodie, and a jacket. But by lunch, if I don't take all that off, I may or may not get heat stroke. But when I get off work, when the sun starts going down, if I haven't put my thermals and jackets back on, frostbite may be a potential. You hear that? That's exactly right, actually. That is a great explanation of what we need to do. Guys, did everybody else hear that? That's a good one right there. Also, another quick tip, hot hands and ear protection for everyone working outside. Also, to our supervisors and managers present, please, gentlemen, Keep your heaters set under 71 degrees. And remember, if you let one of your helpers sit in the truck, you have to let all of your helpers sit in the truck. Now let's go have a great work day and stay warm until it's hot.